And on February 17th, the Finishers Championship between strongmen Eddie Hall, Mitchell Hooper, and Brian Shaw, along with Martin Ford, were supposed to compete in an MMA tournament in Qatar, Saudi Arabia. Brian Shaw posted an update recently on his MMA training, and he said at the beginning of the video that if the fight falls through, it is not his fault, which is awful suspicious. Brian Shaw was supposed to be facing Martin Ford in the first round of the tournament. John Parr said six months ago I received a WhatsApp notification from Qatar asking if I could speak to me about a fight opportunity. The promotion was going to be a master with all the retired superstars on one event. Names like Conor McGregor, Floyd Mayweather, GSP, Khabib, Darren Till, and Mike Perry were being mentioned with the opportunity to be on the same card. To make it sound even more legit, superstars like Eddie Hall, Martin Ford, Brian Shaw, and Mitchell Hooper we're supposed to be in a four-man elimination on the same event. Now he goes into the details of the contract. It was a $20 million offer, which is $30 million Australian. The first million was to be paid 16 weeks out from the event. Here's the pay schedule. This event was supposed to have a $300 million payout, which is the largest payout out of any pay-per-view event in history. Here's supposed to be the pay structure for the $20 million. $1 million would be paid 16 weeks out from the fight, $5 million would be paid one week out from the fight, and $14 million would be paid the day after the fight. Like and subscribe if you learned something new today. Check out one of the suggested videos. And a shout out goes to Sean Jones for the info regarding this event.